folks, we return once again with our tasty shark world. What? Unfortunately. Unfortunately, we are indeed back. Also, so Joey and I were talking ga talking potential games we could play, and the Slender of the Arrival came up, and that reminded me. So you know what I watched yesterday? It's like a blast from the past. Uh, Merrick plays Slender. Oh my god. Yeah, right? <laughs> He didn't. He apparently did a whole Slender the Arrival Let's Play, but as Merrick. I, you know, I would love to if we ever got the chance on, on the Switch. I'd, I'd love to play Slender the Arrival. Oh yeah, I'll see if it's on. I'll if it like goes on sale anytime between now and October. I'll probably pick it up. <laughs> I, I remember uh, just just having such a blast with uh, with you and Owen playing. Oh yeah, that was great. Honestly. And hilariously enough, that was... Okay, I find it hilarious how... Okay, so when we watch, like, horror movies together, I'll still get, like, uneasy at night afterwards. Yeah. But, like, if we play a horror game... I was a bit afraid during Slender the Arrival, because I'm like, oh, am I not going to be able to sleep tonight? But, no. <laughs> Weirdly enough, with horror games, like, I slept like a baby. <laughs> well, it, it, it's, it's, you know, one of those things where if, if you have your friends, you know, by you, like they're you know making you laugh and everything it, it you know normally doesn't doesn't get you as much you know what like when we were when you and not you nick and i were watching uh lost tapes yeah 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 and you guys were like tearing at a new one <laughs> yeah see that's the thing we just make fun of it and then it's a, you know then it's like then it, yeah i still find it funny how i watched i watched that whole series and it scared the shit out of me. <laughs> I was really proud of you when you you decided to uh, go and see it. Oh yeah. So, I mean, granted, by by it too, like. <laughs> that one was la That one was, was not a horror movie. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you know, e e e well, but like, I don't. And I'm not saying like it is like the you know scariest movie out there or anything like that. But like, that was a big step for you. It was, yeah. Mm-hmm. Meanwhile, I'm s I was scared by Barney. <laughs> I, that's, that's fair. I mean... <laughs> well, you, I showed you the the tape, the specific tape, remember? That was the one with the little... Oh, the wait, little... Wait, 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 hold on. Can I take, can take a guess? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. The one where they're camping in the woods? Yeah, and then the little girl gets lost. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that scared the shit out of me. That was like a le That's like a legit fear, though. <laughs> What, like know. the... Oh yeah, Thomas has a ton of them, like, that are, like, super dark if you think about it. Yeah, like, like, classic Thomas, though. Yeah! The one that comes to mind is when, uh, Henry didn't want to come out of the tunnel in order... Because he didn't want to get his paint... His paint dirty. So they just locked him in there. Yeah. They're like, okay, you want to stay in that tunnel? Okay, you can stay in that tunnel. FOREVER! Wasn't there... Like... Oh my god, I... I... There was like, I have a whole tape titled Spills and Chills, where it's literally a tape with all of the Thomas episodes with disasters in them, or, or, uh, what's it called? Um, disasters or, oh, ghosts. Like spooky shenanigans happening. I mean, there was actually an episode of Thomas where Stepney got taken to the scrapyard accidentally, and these two diesels were literally about to like about to let him get scrapped. Which I don't want to work with a stinky steam engine. Ah yes, Thomas the Race War. <laughs> My favorite. Uh
<laughs> See, this is so crazy that Joey's having a stroke. Oh, I agree. Like there was one where this one train wouldn't stop like rumbling as he uh as he was uh going down the rails. So you know what they did? They took off his wheels and turned him into a generator. That's that's the but they're alive. Yeah, I know, right? Chopping someone's legs off. <laughs> exactly. And then just like hooking them up to hooking their heart up to like a generator to power something. Uh oh. Oh come on, I'm so close. I think it was like Oh one yes. Of the, like, one of the oh like, they didn't want to stay behind or something. And so one of the trains like came up behind them and then just like pushed them like for for a long period of time. Uh-huh. Thomas in, 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 a, in a hot minute. Yeah. Hot, hot, <laughs> I only have time for cold sex, Eric. <laughs> I see. Did you ever see the one with the boulder? I think so. That sounds familiar. The one with, like, Rusty sees, like, this boulder and he thinks it's possessed. And then the boulder actually comes after him. <laughs> see, that actually sounds kind of funny. <laughs> oh, it's, it's nuts. But yeah, the, uh... The boulder was act was it was it's kind of left up to interpretation whether or not the boulder's alive or this is all like in Rusty's imagination, but it's in depth. what Th 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 Thomas is getting in, in depth. Like honestly though, and the uh... yeah the <laughs> the thing nearly crushes like three trains as they had to like oh. back. They have to like back up really fast in order to get away from it. They like crash into other stuff. And right when you think it's about to like kill Percy, it like goes by him and then it crashes into a uh into a shed with a gigantic explosion. <laughs> and no one survived. <laughs> I believe that was Alec Baldwin. Oh man, he, he, that, 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 that was normally like the like tamer stuff, where it's like if you heard a British voice, you knew you were in for, a, for a, the ride of your life. Well, you know who that was, right? The British guy. That's Ringo. Are you kidding? No, it's Ringo. <laughs> I have so this is what he's been doing all this time. I have several Thomas tapes. Like, remember how I told you I got like 20 of them from Goodwill for like f for like 50 cents a piece? <laughs> yeah, like half of them are uh, say starring Ringo Starr. And I was like, oh. Hey guys, you hear about the talking trains? <laughs> Ringo, are, are you from the future? <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, I, uh, I live, yes, I, I am. I live two of you. <laughs> <laughs> Which two? I'm not gonna say. <laughs> What? Yeah, they, 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 uh, they, 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 they were saying that because, um, uh, he, he, I, I don't know if he, he, he actually wrote it, but I know the Beatles have a song called Octopus's Garden. And it's written by Ringo? I, I don't know. I mean, I would, I'd assume. I see. You know, you know what they say about assuming? It makes an ass out of you and me. Well, we're already asses, so. I, I did, did, yeah, yeah, I got it, Joey. <laughs> I do, actually. We got a new shark. Hey, Joe, we got a new shark. We got a new shark? We got a hammerhead. Hey. That's pretty good. That's mildly adequate. That's almost all right. That's, that sucks. That's bad. <laughs> you know what? That's actually kind of terrible. Really? And there's actually, they're actually really interesting. <coughs> oh, Bless you. thank you. Ugh. Bless you also. 
Herc was in Seoul. Herc really likes foals. But, Herc was uh, on a scroll. It, 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 it's kind of neat because like, he, he takes someone that's like uh, relatively internet famous. Uh -huh. um, but uh, and, and like just these really interesting personalities. Yeah. Uh, and, and you know he kind of I don't know. Whereas like content cop, he's like kind of making fun of them and everything. And, uh huh. And, 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 Uh-huh. Maybe we should hit him up, see if we can get some recognition, eh? We should hit him up, see if we can get some recognition on the show. Oh, I know? Yeah. I, 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 see, we're weird. I don't know if we're that weird. No, we're pretty weird. <laughs> but yeah. That, yeah I, normal's overrated, man. Yeah, I was actually, apparently Nathan tipped me off to, uh, apparently, uh, Mr. Beast is doing something with, uh, lesser known... YouTubers, so I I hit him up and said, said, said if we could you know there's something that's going on. <laughs> yeah, so I'm awaiting a response. Alrighty then. Yeah, let's hope that uh, Mr. Beast comes comes to our aid because we need we need uh need help. <laughs> what? No, we're 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 <laughs> we got 30 subscribers. I think we're I think we're happy. And that's thirty more than we started out. With. That's right. It's been like what a year and a half now. <laughs> that is a neat effect. Hey, there it is. Great hammerhead. Doesn't look so great. I've yep. seen better. Oh, oh, now it's great. Yeah, now he's got a witch doctor thing. Now he's got a sword. And a boat. And a bow tie. And a mustache. You got anything else? A sweatband. A Put everything on him. A force field. A jetpack. A recy a laser. A recycling cannon. A, a baby <laughs> hammer. Yeah. This is the, this is the mecha shark that they speak of in the in the, in the cheesy B movies. Yay. <laughs> He's also got friends, including Jasper the Ghost Shark. Oh, of course. Of course. Jasper the Ghost Shark. It's, no, it's Jasper. Oh, Jasper. Not Casper. Oh, I'm sorry, of course. We want to avoid copyright infringement if possible. Of course. <laughs> Switching out one letter should more than suffice. You know, speaking of, like, oh. kids shows Excuse me. that has some, like, oddly adult themes in them, mm -hmm. I thought you were talking about the old cartoon. I'm like, no, they didn't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Casper's dropping F bombs left and right, man. Hey, Casper, why don't you go scaring with us? Or are you a little wimp? <laughs> you know what? Fuck you, <laughs> Uncle Slim. Whoa, Casper. <laughs> you know what? I'm done being friendly to you, <laughs> ass bags. <laughs> Yeah, CFG! Casper the fucking ghost! No way, come on, because I'm gonna fuck ya! <laughs> Hand forms into a tilt. Ah! I don't know how to respond to that. No one does, Joey. No one does. But yeah, no. Do you say Matilda? What? Wait, what, what, what? what? I said forms hand into a dildo. It proceeds to fuck them with it. Cause I was like, Matilda's another one that's, like, strangely dark. Yeah, honestly. Though, apparently it's got, like, a really heartwarming behind the scenes. Uh, what, what, what was that one, one, one teacher's name? Tr Trunchbull? Trunchbull. The absolute worst. <laughs> and, uh, leaving off on that, that is, that is the nowhere end we, that, it, episode's over. <laughs> <laughs> I just had a stroke. <laughs> oh, God. All right, see you guys next time. <laughs>